Hello everyone buddy, it's KG Chaos. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to duplicate any item that is in DayZ. This is for PS4. So if you guys are on PS4, this is working for this. The only requirements is you guys need to go and join a community for on the PlayStation, a DayZ community. So you can join someone's session, that's how you get this to work. Um, I'm pretty sure you can join your friends too if they're in a different lobby, but they can't be in the same one. So what you want to do is you want to make it to where when you double tap your PlayStation button, it's instantly already on the join session button. So you guys can join as quickly as possible. If you guys don't have to do that, I'll make a video so you guys can know how to do that. But it's really easy to do. You just scroll down and you have the cursor or the little thing outlined on join session. And then you just double tap the PlayStation button again to go back to the game. As you guys see that was in my inventory is a shovel what you want to do is wait about 45 seconds have that item or whatever you're duplicating in your hands for 45 seconds at least and then as soon as you drop it you're going to want to drop it on the ground but as soon as you hold it you see it leave your hands double tap playstation button click join session and then it should bring you back to the screen it'll instantly start loading you into a that server but if sometimes it does not work if you get into a queue most likely it doesn't work sometimes it does but if you join into a session it should still be in your hands and you guys will know that it actually worked as you'll see me showing here like i said it works for any item i will show you guys three, me doing it three different times or three different things so you guys can see that it actually does work but as you see me here the shovel is in my hand as you can see all you want to do is exit and then go back to your server that you are on whether it being the server that you want to have like your base on, something like that. Just whatever it is, is go back to the server where you dropped that item. And wherever you dropped it, it'll still be there. And there you have it. You will be duplicating an item as I'll show you guys here very soon. But like I said, when you get back out of that lobby, just go down until you find the server that you're in. So make sure you memorize that server that you are in. Go down to it, join it, and guys, as soon as you're in it, just walk over. It's kind of dark in my server, so you can't really see until I pick it up and show you my inventory. The next one I show you will be daytime so you guys can see it. But as you see me walk over here, the shovel is in my inventory. And then I'm going to walk over to the tree that I was at. If you guys can see it, it's really dark. This game is just super dark, and I don't understand why, but I guess I do know why. But anyways, here's a tree that I was by, and you see right here, the shovel is on the ground. You're going to do go ahead and pick it up. And then you see the one right here in my hands, and then the other one's going to be inside my inventory, but right there you see it out the vicinity. So next, I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to duplicate an M4A1. So make sure if you guys duplicate any weapon, you take the magazine out of it because sometimes it does glitch it out and you won't be able uh, to take the mag out sometimes on them. So just make sure you take out the mag, just get rid of the whole problem right there. Then all you want to do, like I said, you want to double tap your PlayStation button to join that server, but make sure you drop the item and as soon as you see it coming out of your hands, double tap PlayStation button, join their session. As you see me here, I'll be logging out of this session and be joining the other one. And now that I'm in this session, you guys will be able to see that the M4 is still in my hands. The mag is not in it. So make sure you guys take that mag out. It's good. And exit this server. And do exactly what I did last time. Just go down in the session list until you find the one you're in. Go back over to on the ground where you dropped the item. And it still, stood, it still should be sitting there. Now, as soon as I'm doing this session, my friends had a fire going, but it instantly died as soon as I joined. So I just walk over and see it on the ground and pick it up. As you see there, it's still in my inventory. I walk down over here and it's going to show it up on the ground. And I'm also going to pick it up and show you guys in my inventory that it is there. See the one here in my hands. Then I go over and then there's one right here inside of my uh, my backpack. So there you have it. That's the weapon one. And now I'm going to duplicate this filled backpack. As you've seen all of the items there, I'll show you guys of the comparison when I get back into this lobby. But again, you're going to drop the item and as soon as you see it drop out of your hands, double tap that PlayStation button after you wait 45 seconds. Make sure you guys, whatever you have duplicating, it stays in your hands for 45 seconds before you go ahead and go ahead and join to a different session. So as soon as you drop the item, double tap your uh, PlayStation button, join their session, and then you'll get into that lobby. And if it's still in your hands, that means it worked in your friends. If there is friends in your lobby, they can go ahead and pick up that backpack Go ahead and start spreading out them items and things like that.
And now as you can see, when I get into the lobby, it does say filled backpack is in my hands. It's really dark, but you can see in the bottom left corner that it does show that it is still in my hands. Now, when you guys are done with that, go ahead and do the exact same thing. Just go to the server list and find the server that you guys were in and then uh, just join it back. And then when you join into that server, it should still be on the ground. I'm gonna show you guys a comparison so you guys can see that it actually duplicated that item whenever I find the backpack in this dark. So if you guys compare here, see everything is the same, the vicinity one on the ground and the one in my hands, everything's exactly the same. I duplicated the item. Super easy to do guys, really, really easy to do. Just make sure if you get if you get into a queue, you go ahead and back out and go back to your server because sometimes that does not work at all. You actually have to join the server immediately and not get into a queue. But just to recap, what you're gonna do is go ahead and get in a DayZ community um, and go down to where you can join somebody and then double tap your PS button uh, so it brings you back to the game. And then after you sit there and wait 45 seconds, make sure you walk around a little bit with whatever item that's in your hand. After you do that, go ahead and drop the item as soon as you see it fall out of your hands. Double tap that PlayStation button, join that session, and then when you get into that session, if it's in your hand still, your friends are, or your friends, if they're in there, are good to go with bringing everything out of that bag and kind of separating it and things like that. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. That's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll hope to see you guys in my next video.